Hello you guys! Welcome back to my Chanel. My name is Stacia Zapuaca. If you've never been here before, but if you have, hi girl. Okay, but I'm gonna put on chapstick antes de empezar este vlog. Oh my goodness, you guys. If you guys recognize this outfit, it's because today I finished the other vlog, like from when I went shopping in Cabazon. But today's also the day where I'm getting my nails done. So I'm not wearing the same thing, it's just the same day. But anyway, you guys, today's a very special day because today we're doing a nail vlog. Okay, if you've been here for years, then you know back in the day, like in 2020, I used to do nail vlogs. Like I used to do really long pedazzo nails and that was a lot of fun. But now we moved on to hard gel nails. Now, I think I did a last nail vlog I did was for my engagement nails. These are not my engagement nails. These are just like my whatever nails. But I don't know if I told you guys, but I have been doing hard gel on my nails. Basically with hard gel, it's like an overlay over your natural nails to help strengthen and to help the growth of your natural nail. So yo me inspiré de mi hermana because my sister has actually been coming to this girl that I'm going to for like the past year and a half. And my sister's natural nails are so, 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 so long. So I wanted to try and do like the hard gel overlay and to see how it would do or whatever. And you guys, like when you come here and you have never been here before, she will cut your nails really short and then you'll kind of start from zero. I came three weeks ago and look at how much my nails have grown. Can you kind of see like the growth? I don't know if you can see because like obviously it's like a nail color color, but my nails have grown so much. Look at the bottom of them in three weeks. Now take it, my nails don't really grow super fast. So I'm really excited to continue to do the hard gel overlay. And today I'm actually even more excited because you guys helped me pick out the design that I'm gonna get. So, si no sabes, para que te enteres. On Instagram, I always ask you guys for your opinion on different things. So I put a bunch of different nail videos to see which ones I should get. And I'm gonna show you which one won. So for example, there was this one, which was just like a natural nail, like very pinky nude. Then it was that one that kind of had a, that had kind of blue. I liked that one, but you guys didn't. That one you guys absolutely hated. I actually was into the cow nails, but you guys were not. And these ones are the ones that are winning so far. So it looks like we're going to go with these ones. And those were the last ones, but they, they did well, but not as well as the other ones. So if you want to follow me on Instagram to help pick out my next nails, definitely follow me. But I'm really excited. I, I've been coming to my sister's nail girl. We're going to go in there and get our beautiful nails done. And I'm going to tell you guys how much I pay. I will tell you guys right off the get go. Um, the the hard gel overlay is a little bit more expensive than acrylic so you are gonna pay a pretty penny at least where i come um she's a little bit pricier than like if you were just gonna get like gel nails so it's up to you depending on what you want to do and how you feel comfortable this is harder than gel like if you guys notice like look my nails are hard so it's not like it's just gel polish, you know? So she does buff it out. She does um, give it its shape and stuff. I'm definitely gonna film for you guys. I'm gonna tell you how much I paid at the end of it. And yeah, come with me so we can get my nails done. This is the before. Very beautiful, very grown now. I literally cannot believe how much my nails have grown. Oh my goodness. Also, it is a total an accomplishment for me to wait three weeks between nail sets because usually i get my nails done every week and a half every week and a half to every two weeks so this was great for me so let's go in there let's get our nails done how excited and then yeah a ver como salimos ahorita
Hey guys, acabo de salir de hacerme las uñas. Me quedaron bien bonitas. And there's actually an Ulta like right down the building. So I'm gonna go get some face, well, some hyaluronic acid and some spray water for my face. No sé si spray water, I forgot how to say it. But I'm gonna go get some of that to Ulta real quick. And then after that, ya nos vamos a la casa. Pero me quedaron bien bonitas. Okay, so we didn't do initially what we had planned. Pero es porque la Debbie, I think we should, you should do this one. And I was like, okay, I'll do that one. I'm not really that hard to convince. So we're gonna go into the Ulta. Hold on. Oh my goodness, I'm back. Woo. Ya fui a Ulta. Oh my goodness, you guys. And I got some really good stuff. Oh, okay, okay, okay. Hace calor. So let me turn on the car. Oh my goodness, you guys are gonna love my nails. I'm obsessed with them. But first, let me show you what I got. So lately I've been feeling like my skin's a little dehydrated. So, I got a facial spray with aloe, chamomile, and lavender from Mario Badescu. So, I got this one. And then, I also got... I also got the Ordinary Hyaluronic Acid. So, I watched this TikTok of this girl saying that she first does facial spray and then she does hyaluronic acid to like absorb uh como se llama to absorb hydration into her face so i was like i want to do that and then también vi este caffeine solution for your eyes i don't know if it works or not but i got it you know so that's what i got at ulta you guys let me show you my nails they're gorgeous look at how cute they are they match my ring and everything. They're gorgeous. So, ya que me crecieron un poquito más las uñas, I feel like they look a little bit better. But I'm kind of obsessed with short nails right now. Like, I feel like they look so classy, so put together. And they're so easy to have. And you can literally do anything. O sea, te puedes abrochar todos los collares. Te puedes subir el zipper. You can do anything with short nails. And these are my natural nails. So, I feel like they look really, really gorgeous. They match my ring but remember what i was telling you about when it comes to hard gel okay i don't know if this is everybody who does hard gel so you guys let me know or if it's just my girl which she is a little bit pricier than like the regular nail tech i think these were 90 dollars so i don't know if that's higher than average or if that's about how much people are paying for hard gel nails. I personally think it's worth it. But I mean, si vale la pena porque she's super talented and she's like always booked. So it's worth it for me. Um, like to cut, like, I like the fact that I found somebody who I can come to all the time. And I asked her, cause I know she charges per nail art, like per nail. So I was like, is French like just like a set price? So she said French is $90, I mean, French is $20 on top of whatever you're getting. So I think for the hard gel fill, I'm probably paying around $70. I ended up giving her $20 tip. So all together, it ended up coming out to $110. The good thing is I'm not coming as often. I'm coming every three weeks. So my next appointment's not till another three weeks. So I don't really mind. Um, it's worth it for me. What do you guys think though? Like, you let me know if you have ever gotten hard gel. I'm obsessed with it right now, but obvio no es para todo el mundo. And I understand that some of you guys still like the longer nails, you know? And obviously the longer nails, like the acrylic is a lot more affordable when like, it's not like this pricey, you know? But look, let me show you the nails. This is what they look like. They're really cute, really nice, really simple. I personally am obsessed with this. Se me hace que se ven bien limpias, se ven bien classy, se ven bien. Like, it just looks like a really nice manicure, and I'm obsessed with it. I really am obsessed with it. So, yeah, you guys, we're gonna go home now because this, if not, this is gonna be like a super short vlog, which, you know, I'm okay with it, but I do know that you guys like to hang out. So, uh, I'm about to drive home, I'm gonna make something to eat, and then. Yeah, I'll see you guys at the house, maybe. Or is this the end of the vlog? I don't know. I'll see you guys at the house, maybe.